Hello, and welcome to Black Arts Live. Consider this a virtual field trip, a tour of the artist's studio, a glimpse into how a poet thinks. And what you see in here are various problems. So these are these are some of these are things that I would hear as a child growing up in the Caribbean. I am a chamber soul cellist and singer-songwriter. I've lived in Morocco now for four years and I feel and see my work, my imagination, opening up in beautiful ways. Another teacher that wanted me to be in the Black History play as Iman and all I had to do was say one line which was, my name is Iman, I'm the highest paid supermodel in the world. The West is known for musicians and I've been inspired in many ways by the people around me. My mother and father are Jamaican and Nigerian. This has continued to influence who I am and the type of art that I make. We're not post-racial. We are evolving as a democracy. Somehow I want us to reclaim our faith and our art. 